everyone, today I'm gonna interview some very special Colombia people that live here at Melbourne. One of them is a famous singer in the band Amaru Tribe. And one of the on the other person, she is an artist and a muralist here at Melbourne. So if it's real, then darling, let me know. is very awesome it's beautiful and as you may already know I'm doing a research about how Colombian culture and Colombian people impact Australian culture Wow Tori thank you so much for coming and to do this beautiful meeting we, we are super excited to hear that someone as young as you is interested in in this beautiful mixture of cultures yes, thank, thank you, you. Gracias. yes this place is awesome and you guys are really talented Thank you, so much. Thank you so much. Could you please tell the audience and the people here listening uh, what do you do, like what's your work, what's your talent, and what's your name? Well, my name is Oscar and I'm a music producer, singer in a Mali tribe and I play various instruments, synthesizer, guitar, charango, uh, gaita, which are like South American instruments. Oh, that's really interesting. <laughs> the visual art and music and in music I mostly sing and I play the tambora uh, Colombian drum and I'm also part of Amaru tribe. <laughs> We get to transmit a lot of our art and music and culture to the Australian audiences, so it's always a very easy way to connect with the local audiences. For us, I think I've been 20 years in Australia and I've seen more and more interest of Australian people wanting to know more about Colombian uh, culture, so I think it's a mixture of you know, the love uh, that you give to people 
transmitting our culture, our colonial culture, and you know all the different people that also bring in food, bring in you know I don't know different products or good friendships, good moments with colonial people. I think. Yeah, I think um, Colombian culture and Latin American culture in general have a beautiful, beautiful way to gather people around many expressions, and I think we bring that a lot here. We are people that you know are sort of like haired people like manada you know um and and i think that's an element that that really connects in australia uh there's just such a wide diverse you know range of communities in a very small area we australia and melbourne is very multicultural so you really need to create sp spaces for all of these cultures to come and connect and i think um Latin, America, Latin American culture can do that a lot. It can open these spaces, these warm and joyful and colorful spaces for people to connect. Um, I think that's one of the, the beauties. Thank you so much. That's an awesome, an awesome example and that's true and it's something really cool about our culture. <laughs> I would, I would love to recommend for all of you to watch this music video we did called Seprendio or The Party Has Started by Maru We love the song, but also we collaborated with an Australian animator called Drop Bear, and that was a, an incredible mixture of of both talents and both worlds of Colombia and Australia coming together in the one video clip. So I definitely recommend you check that one out. Yeah, it sounds really multicultural. I'm certainly gonna listen to that song. In Frankston Library, it's a mural. You can check out my Instagram or website and you will find it there. It's part of the Big Picture Festival. Oh yeah, I, I took a look at that artwork today and it's awesome. It's the little girl with the rainbows, yes. yeah. It's, it's beautiful, it has a lot of detail and it's really realistic. So yeah. it's an awesome artwork. Yeah, I really like painting um, children from, you know, young, young, people like people from your generation because I think you are the future so I like having that inspiring you know element in my in my work I help I help paint the rainbow she did. <laughs> I was there as a this is another support. hidden talent from Oscar sometimes he comes and helps help. all right that's very nice you guys do an excellent team working that's awesome um, and your artworks are amazing all right so the last question is uh, which advice would you give to Australian people about Colombian culture and yes well 
One of the ways that I've seen Australians connect a lot to, to Colombia is through coffee. Like, Melbourne people love coffee and Colombia is one, we produce beautiful coffee. Coffee. Hola! One bell dance! Buenos días. Buenos días. Disfruto un buen café. Gracias, señor. Adiós. Adiós. Now that's fresh mountain grown coffee from the hills of Colombia. Coffee, and that's because we have incredible nature and, and natural environments that produce, you know, um, incredible streams. But also, I guess, could be a, a nice way for you to uh, try some food. There's some cafes around here, and definitely the music. Have a listen to some of our music. We have um, quite a wide range. a big movement of Latin American musicians bringing experiences so to come, you. Come and dance at, at a Maru Tribe concert. That's going to be a good That's one way good to step. connect. Because we're making it so easy. We are right here in Melbourne. So uh, next concert, just check out our website. Uh, and you know, we'll send us a message and we'll invite you. I appreciate you guys a lot because you are really talented, um, so thank you a lot and I'm really grateful to be here in this awesome place with this awesome talent, so oh, thank you guys. Thank, thank you, you Tori, we are super grateful and as well grateful with you for spreading the positivity yes. of our culture, I think you're doing an amazing job yes. in that. Thank you so much. Okay. Bye. Ciao. <laughs>